examination in this course is based on blog posts and comments on blog posts, apart from the seminar discussions, of course. And according to the researchers at Oulu University that I presented in the previous video, you need enough time to prepare for examination, no matter what kind of examination. Since this is a course where I only provide you with perhaps a limited amount of materials, you also need time to search for new materials and relevant materials for your blog posts. And the blog posts aren't very long in themselves. But the point is that you will spend quite a lot of time during your writing process looking for relevant materials. Now this is a new forum for most of you and writing in a blog is quite different than writing just a Word document. Now obviously you need to consider your fonts and the aesthetics of your blog post. But you might want to add different kinds of medias, you might want to add pictures, because this is something that really makes a blog post more interesting, at least most of the time. And this is part of a reasoning process that also takes time. And since a lot of you don't know WordPress from before, this is going to take time. So I've been quite generous with the ECTS points for several reasons. One is that you need to get used to both Adobe Connect and WordPress. This is quite different than if we had seminars in a regular classroom. Then you could just come and sit down and we could get talking. But here we need to get used to the new learning environment. You're also commenting on each other's blog posts. And this is again very individual. Some of you might write short comments quite fast and others need more time to write comments. And again, since a lot of you will be writing in English and you're not native English speakers, you will need more time to do that. And you also need time to read the comments you get and to update your posts according to the comments. And it's equally important to also thank people who've taken time to comment on your posts. So, as you can see, my ECTS points aren't adding up. But since I'm considering the learning environment and, unfortunately, the fact that we do need some extra time to get microphones and sound working in Adobe Connect, I've decided to be generous with the ECTS points and hope that this will be an overall interesting, inspiring and rewarding learning process for all of you for different reasons.